Whatever we want you to see, you will see. The newest science fiction series on Netflix, Three Body Problem, starts out with a number of enigmatic connections that leave fans wondering about the true significance of the strange countdown. Even the gifted scientist is baffled as to why the numbers, which manifest as days, hours, minutes, and seconds, flash before the main heroine Augustino Augie Salazar. Although the series straddles multiple timelines, it opens with a visceral and disturbing execution during the Chinese Cultural Revolution. A young Yi Wenji witnesses her father, who is a professor and scientist, get beaten to death. Later, she's conscripted by the military because of her aptitude for astrophysics. Working on a remote military base, Yi Wenji eventually makes an incredibly ambitious fateful decision one with ramifications that echo across time to the story's present-day thread. As a result, contemporary physicists begin inexplicably dying, including Yi Wenji's own daughter. In the first episode of Three Body Problem, viewers are introduced to the Oxford Five, a group of friends who all studied physics at the titular university. One of them, research assistant Saul Durand, has a dark realization one night. Saul tells his boss, physicist Vera Yee, that science is broken. Although Vera tries to be more encouraging, the pair deduce that the last 60 years of physics has been upended by a recent discovery. That night, Vera dies by suicide in the lab's cavernous reactor, marking yet another mysterious death of a world-renowned scientist. Meanwhile, two other Oxford Five members, Jin Cheng and Augie, discuss the anomalies in their fields of work. When Augie glances over at a TV screen in the bar, her vision seems to glitch. Although she tries to blink away the strange orange static, it forms numbers. A countdown. While outside Vera's funeral, a mysterious woman approaches Augie, telling her to not let the countdown hit zero. Later on, it's revealed that the countdown appears thanks to Sofin's proton-sized 11-dimensional supercomputers, created by the series' alien race, the Santee, to spy on humans. Why Wade sees the countdown at the end of Three-Body Problem? The mysterious woman asks Augie if she's ever seen the universe wink and tells her to watch the sky at midnight. Still dealing with the countdown, Augie does as the woman instructs. Seemingly, the night sky and its stars flash on and off though it's something everyone on Earth is able to witness. Netflix's three-body problem is full of bizarre happenings, generally stemming from the Santee. The alien race is headed to Earth, though they won't arrive for 400 years. Using sofans, they try to send a warning. However, these warnings are more for their own benefit. Three-body problems countdowns are designed by the Santee to stop certain scientists from continuing their research. They know that certain research could lead to discoveries that empower humanity, and they don't want Earth's technology exceeding their own. At first, Augie, who runs a company that designs self-assembling synthetic polymer nanofibers, is the target, but at the end of three-body problem, Wade, Liam Cunningham, sees the countdown. While it's not entirely clear, Wade was overseeing the staircase project to intercept the Santee fleet. Clearly, the aliens know Wade is onto something that could obstruct them. What happens when the countdown hits zero? Any type of countdown that appears, especially one that is unidentified, suggests that a horrible event is almost certain to occur. The countdown that appears in front of people's eyes is the best tool available to the Santee and the Sofin to frighten them, as their interactions with humans are limited. The Santee hope said that scientists would literally not trust their own eyes if they played tricks on Augie and other scientists. As a result, they might be too afraid to carry out their crucial study or fail to create technology that can match the Santee's capabilities. The Sofans and the countdown they cause essentially create rather meaningless phenomena. By running interference, the phenomena distract, scare, and manipulate Earth's leading scientific minds into abandoning their projects or, even more tragic, the countdowns result in their deaths due to all the mental duress. It's not made clear what would happen if the countdown reached zero, but it's likely the Santee and their Sofans couldn't do much more than threaten humans and hope these empty menaces play out in their favor in the contemporary set timeline of three-body problem.